Welcome back for another Solana Prize prediction analysis and in this video I will be sharing my next price targets and also give you reasons why Solana can see a break above the $25 mark in the next coming hours and before I do so show some love by first giving this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and also check out the channel membership and at the time of this recording Solana is holding below a significant area of resistance at around the $22.7 mark and I'm expecting that in the next coming hours in case we continue gearing up we are going to break above that key area of resistance get a successful retest and continue unlocking higher prices and get above the $24 mark in the next coming hours Solana has also seen a break above this descending trend line that I have here on the charts where you can see that we saw the breakout to the upper side we have now seen a retest of this descending trend line and soon I'm expecting that Solana is going to give us a reaction of that retest and continue gearing up to the upper side and maybe possibly in the next coming days get above the $30 mark once more Solana has also continued to obey the ADOTF structures where we have been seeing a bit of a breakdown move in the formation of this wave 4 in a move that has now fully maximized minimum retracement areas for that wave 4 highlighted on the charts using this yellow target area which is an area that we have now fully maximized and there are high chances that we have a low in place for that wave 4 and soon we are going to see a reaction of the target area and start gearing up impulsively in the formation of this wave 5 which is what we expect after seeing a breakdown move in the formation of this wave 4 and before I give you target areas in the formation of this wave 5 allow me to first give you a recap of what has been happening since the 10th of June when we had this massive breakdown giving us a low at around the $12.97 mark and afterwards we started gearing up impulsively where we have now been able to put in place the high for that first wave so a breakdown move in the formation of this wave 2 a wave 3 giving us a high at around the $32 mark then we started our breakdown move in the formation of this wave 4 and soon I'm expecting that Solana is now going to give us that wave 5 to the upper side and giving you the minimum target areas for that wave 5 to the upper side by connecting the trend based Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave 1 then dragging the Fibs to the high of that wave 3 I get a minimum target area in the formation of that wave 5 at the Fib level 0 0.618 and that is at around the $35.24 mark and that is the minimum that you can expect Solana to do in the formation of that wave 5 and that is what I'm keeping my eyes on here on the short term and also remember that in case we see further breakdown then the next key area of support that we need to keep our eyes on is at around the $21.42 mark where we can find support and then see another bounce back to the upper side to also give you my long term analysis still basing it on the ADOTF structures if I jump to the 4 hour chart for further analysis you can see that after seeing the December lows down here we picked in a 5 wave structure giving us a high above the $27 mark completing the formation of this larger area to have count 1 then we started a breakdown move in the formation of this wave 2 into the minimum retracement area highlighted on the charts using this yellow target area and the high chances that you also have a low in place for the second wave we have now seen a reaction of the target area and whatever we are seeing at the moment is the start of an impulse in the formation of this wave 3 so that is what I'm keeping my eyes on here on the Solana chart on the short term and also on the long term also taking a look at the indicators on the RSI we are trading at around the 39 mark fully supporting higher prices on the MACD we have been able to print a bullish cross fully supporting higher prices so let's be patient and see how that plays out and i will be keeping you up to date